time. Here are the favorites. Kyoko Ina and John Zimmerman trying to win their first gold medal. They talked to us earlier this week about how much they wanted to win here. Yeah, I got to... I mean, I, I, I would love to have this just for myself, too, you know. But, uh, you know, pairs is a team sport. And, uh, that's just the outlook we have on it. And I would love to do it with Kyoko. It's so <laughs> Very much. Nice. Scott and Dulaban in the lead right now over Spielberg and Joe Wright, McGarrian and Guzman in third. But here are Kyoko Ina and John Zimmerman. Kyoko has won two national titles of her own. Of course, that was with her former partner, Jason Dungeon. But now with John, second season together, trying to capture gold for the first time. Last year, it was silver. And their music is from the soundtrack, The Truman Show. One of the things to notice in their skating is her style, the back that she has, how straight it is, and what perfect position it's in. She has marvelous extension and stretch. And I see a lot more confidence in their presentation on the ice, just even from these first few moves. They are opening side by side, triple toe loops, very solid. Look at that nice unison, very crisp. Oh, oh, did you see how out turned out she was? In the middle of the air, her body started to lean right out of the circle. And usually she gets such lift in those jumps. It gives her a lot of time to get in the correct position for the landing. This pair has had great unevenness in their technical moves. And unless they can become more consistent in that situation, they're just not going to be able to attack the domination of some of the top Russian pairs. But this unison here on these side-by-side -side spins is very good. The positions are good. The unison is good. And this is what they have improved on so much. All these transition moves, very sharp, very crisp, and the unison is terrific. of music for them it has real drama to it and their choreography is, is just right on this is the hand to hip lift in their position it's called a star lift in that position actually a flatter star lift and the final move a pair spin combination one change of foot and at least one change of position was a little rough in that transition. When you come in as the overwhelming favorites, there's a lot of pressure that comes along with that. The other top groups from last year out because of injury, as you know. So Ina and Zimmerman wide open. Reigning champs right there. Danielle and Steve Hartzell. Nice hand in the front row. Well, this was by no means Ina and Zimmerman's best performance. It was a very great tentative feeling at the end. They missed that one move uh, earlier in the program. And it, um, I, don't, I don't think they must be terribly satisfied with this. This is their throw, Triple Salco. He got her up in the air, but not the usual height that she usually gets. And she's not very tight in the air. And here is a look at that back inside edge takeoff. Watch that blade going up. She's not as tight in the air. She's not spinning fast enough to complete this revolution. As she comes down, she's leaning out of the circle, and her leg is wrapped. There was no way for her to really save that. Five point four. 
Kyoko and John alongside Igor Moskvin, the husband of Tamara Moskvina, who's over coaching Beresnaya and Secret Leads at the European Championships. Required element marks 5.2 to 5.6. And those are extremely high marks and considerably ahead of Scott and Dulibon. And now presentation marks take 5.5 to 5.8, and those are high enough to put Ina and Zimmerman in the lead over Scott and Dulabon at this moment. And that's really very interesting, the height and the, and the depth of those marks when one considers that one has to take anywhere from one to four tenths of a point off for the failure of that throw jump. Hey, Ice House, thank you so much. Good.